on your antenna. Cause there's your girl. Come on and show them what you can do. I got a confession to make. Friends. I've uh, hey, how long does Virgo season go? I've been real sporadic in the last two weeks. Well, last week I got sick, so I wasn't feeling well. So this week, today was a long day. Had a went to Tech Week. And tech, another Tech Week event. Uh, today. Yesterday and all week, should have took you with me, but I didn't. My apologies. Uh, so, yeah, it's been a, it's been a doozy. Um, then I also went to the Federal Reserve Bank, had an event, um, well, a little training to do there, and uh, a couple meetings. Um, big week this week too. Apple uh, announced the new iPhone series, so they had a couple and the watch and the Apple TV, not as concerned with the Apple TV as I am with the uh, iPhone X and the the uh, the new Apple Watch. I'm, I'm an Apple Watch guy, but I got the Series 1. And I got a Series 3 now, which is dope. You can, it's a cellular uh, series where you can uh, talk on it and text and get maps and all this other stuff without having your cell phone with you. So you can leave your phone at home and do everything from your watch. It's kind of cool. So I don't know about the battery life uh, because if it has cellular service, obviously it's going to take more batteries. So I don't know what they're going to do with that as far as battery is concerned. Um, but uh, that'd be interesting to see because I'm thinking about getting that. Uh, Pre-sales go are tomorrow. They start tomorrow. So we might. But the iPhone X, I was kind of disappointed in the release date. It's not till like the end of October and not coming out to actually November for the... Uh, the product pre-release is 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 our pre uh, pre-sales is in October, and then the uh, uh, actual uh, distribution of the phone doesn't happen until November, like the first second week in November, something like that. So that's kind of whack. Didn't like that, um, but I'm excited for all the features and all that good stuff. I'm an Apple person. I mean, there's no, there's a, there's always an argument against Apple. And it's always up to de for for debate. So I'm an Apple guy. Kevin, uh, my homeboy Kevin, you saw him in a earlier uh, vlog. He is a, a Google. Um, I was sick. Like I said earlier, I was sick. Been sick. Um, caught the little bug, and I wasn't feeling great last week. And uh, so, but I did get some things. Um, my my new bag came in. Got that. That excited about that, but uh, I just want to. I'm getting caught up on vlog life and emails and uh, everything else. I made a, a ton of people in the last couple days. I got. Um, Everything. I don't know, like, what do you do with business cards? And there are some like really dope folks, man. Some folks that are really doing some great things. I met a photographer. And we had this debate about pictures versus video. Um, I'm a video person, obviously, but she's 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 all about uh, video. I met a brand strategist focuses on social media stuff. Stage, just all kind of folks. So. Tons of business cards. 
I gotta figure out what to do with them. I mean, it's good to follow up with people. I, I, I think that's great. But I like to have a purpose or an intention. Well, you no, know, not just, hey, it was great to meet you. But what can we do? Like, what can I do to work with you? I got, I got some projects that I'm working on. And hopefully, uh, we see those projects come to fruition. I got an email. Let's see who that is. Um, so yeah, so that's kind of what what's been going on with me. Um, so yeah, I'm about to get into this vlog life. I kind of accepted that. I, I, I parked in the middle of the parking lot. I did too. Fifth floor. I did all that good stuff, and I'll probably get a ticket. I went here for law school, so they have my plates and everything. They're like, oh, there she goes. That's what I said. I ain't. I'm not worried about it. I'm with Adrian again. <laughs> and I just met this this guy right here, and he's doing awesome things. So this is breaking news, I don't know. So what is it that you just you submitted for? So uh, there's a little list called Forbes 30 Under 30, and they have a class called Law and Policy. And so I have submitted my application for the class of 2018 under the Law and Policy section. Did you hear what the publication was again? It was Forbes Magazine. So. Dope, dope. Fingers she, crossed. I'm just trying to rub Kansas she'll, City on a big scene. She'll get it. You already know she'll get it. My fingers are crossed, but she'll get it. Speak so. that for your mouth. So Davion uh, has been the staple of the tech community in Kansas City, originally with uh, Digital Sports Ventures, uh, something he founded and acquired, uh, you know, was acquired by, uh, and has, and our uh, final speaker, uh, Jason, has had a industrious uh, career. He's been one of the busiest people I've seen thus far, uh, having gone from uh, creating his own uh, technology analytics company uh, that was acquired by Amazon to you know really getting back involved in the community. So he has uh, charter schools that he's now working on. He has uh, you know nightclubs in uh, Kansas City, which you should ask him about. Uh, and he's really just been a, a force for change in the industry, whether that's still with his uh, position with Amazon or whether that's on a number of the other initiatives. Deal with investor stuff. It was 2008 business was rough, and I came into the office, and I just had a bad attitude, right? And pretty soon, before like two hours, D, this is you, man, this is what you did. And it, 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 it is one of the reasons why it's kind of changed my meaning, you know, like, as a founder, you just need to wear that and deal with it, but you cannot, like, put that on your people. So, that was dope, that was a great event. Uh, it was at, it was a uh, technology event uh, focused on startups. And, you know, they asked at a Q&A. And, uh, it was pretty dope. Pretty dope event, man. I know a lot of people who now, uh, were there, and that was a good thing. Uh, you saw Izzy in there. You saw uh, Davey on there. You saw Ezzy there. Uh, and some other folks that are really big in the, uh, the startup community here in Kansas City, which is uh, pretty dope. So I'm headed now, we're doing a, uh, <laughs> an event down here on uh, 2nd and Paseo at the Housing Authority of Kansas City. So I'm trying to help some folks out down there. And uh, that'll be it, man. That'll be my day when I go home. So. Somebody is in the country illegally. What's wrong with that?